Deuteronomy chapter 31, verses 1 through 13. And Moshe went and spoke these words to all Israel, and he said to them, I am 120 years old today. I am no longer able to go out and come in. And Yahweh has said to me, You do not pass over this yarden. Yahweh your Elohim himself is passing over before you. He shall destroy these nations from before you, and you possess them. Yehoshua himself is passing over before you, as Yahweh has spoken. And Yahweh shall do to them as he did to Sihon and to Og, the sovereigns of the Amorites and their land, when he destroyed them. And Yahweh shall give them over to you, and you shall do to them according to all the command which I have commanded you. Be strong and courageous. Do not fear nor be afraid of them. For it is Yahweh your Elohim who is going with you. He does not fail you nor forsake you. And Moshe called Yehoshua and said to him before the eyes of all Israel, Be strong and courageous, for you are going with this people to the land which Yahweh has sworn to their fathers to give them, and you are to let them inherit it. And it is Yahweh who is going before you. He himself is with you. He does not fail you nor forsake you. Do not fear nor be discouraged. And Moshe wrote this Torah and gave it to the priest, the sons of Levi, who bore the Ark of the Covenant of Yahweh, and to all the elders of Israel. And Moshe commanded them, saying, At the end of seven years, at the appointed time, the year of release, at the festival of Sukkot, when all Israel comes to appear before Yahweh your Elohim in the place which he chooses, read this Torah before all Israel in their hearing. Assemble the people, the men and the women, and the little ones, and your sojourner who is within your gates, so that they hear, and so that they learn to fear Yahweh your Elohim, and guard to do all the words of this Torah. And their children who have not known it should hear and learn to fear Yahweh your Elohim, as long as you live in the land you are passing over the Yarden to possess.